Hello, beautiful people. I'm back today with another video, um, something that I think um, I'm finding very helpful in my manifestation practice, and I think that will help you as well, especially in the area of um, detaching from specific outcomes. So um, I, I posted a, a video a few weeks ago, maybe a month ago, about supercharging your manifestation practice with the vibration of gratitude or uh, appreciation. Um, those, those, especially appreciation, really vibrates um, right up there with love and joy as one of the highest um, feelings that you can have, um, the highest vibrations that you can have. And when you go into you know manifesting, with feelings of gratitude and appreciation for what you already have, um, you know, and not coming from a place of lack or resistance to, you know, what it is that you want, it can really supercharge things. And I'll, I'll link, link that video below if you haven't seen it. But what I want to talk to, to you today is really about taking that gratitude to another level by asking yourself this question. Is what I'm trying to manifest the best for all parties involved? So I'll give you an example. Let's say that I am, um, that I applied for a specific job um, somewhere. And I, I come to it with appreciation for the job I already have that's given me the skills, on um, the confidence maybe necessary for this position that I really want at this particular firm. Um, so, you know, I'm, I'm coming at it, you know, with some gratitude and appreciation, um, but I'm really, I'm really attached to a specific outcome here, this specific job, this specific firm. And, um, you know, you can ask yourself, you know, is this thing that I want, this specific thing, is it gonna be good for all parties involved? So in other words, you know, just because I want something and I'm vibrating at, at, at its equivalency doesn't mean it's necessarily right for me or right for, you know, the, the people who are going to hire me, for my teammates, my coworkers, you know, the firm in general. So, um, so ask yourself that question, you know, is this, is this thing that I want, you know, going to be good for everybody involved? And maybe that will actually help you rethink how, how you're thinking about what you're looking to manifest. Um, and you can kind of rephrase what you're looking for. So maybe instead of, you know, I want this particular job and you can still, you know, ask the universe for this particular thing, if it's right for you, if it is right for all parties involved, is if it's a good fit, then, you know, then uh, this is what I want. But if it's not, open yourself up to the, the possibilities of its equivalent. You know, don't just be, you know, with blinders on focused on this very specific thing when you may miss something even better. Um, so ask for, you know, uh, you know, I really, I think this particular job would be great for me. Um, but if it's not good for all parties involved, then bring me its equivalent. Bring me something just as good or better that I'm better suited for and, and maybe as beyond what I could even imagine. Um, bring that to me, right? So that will help you detach from a specific outcome and, and focus on, on what is good for all parties. So take, and then you can take things another step further, further in, in that feeling of gratitude. So, you know, not only being, feeling into how would I feel if I had this job? How would I feel if I had a, a certain job that was like this, that um, I was really well suited for and would bring me, you know, my desires and would be good for the other firm. But how would that uh, be grateful for how, the other parties involved will feel because I've, I've, you know, I brought something to the table. Uh, I can be grateful that, um, you know, that they are grateful for me being in that position. 
So not only just being grateful for yourself and you know, you got what you wanted, but be grateful for all parties involved that they got what they want um, and what you could bring to the table. Um, and this could be used for anything like a relationship. Maybe it's a specific person you've been trying to manifest, you know, and, and you may feel that's right for you, but is it right for them? You know, is it right for all parties involved? Um, you know, if it's not, then, you know, what's the point? Bring me an equivalent relationship. Bring me something that's just as good or better than this, right? And feel into that and feel how grateful this other person would be for you in their life. You could be the answer to somebody else's prayers, right? How good does that feel? How can we, you know, bring that, that gratitude, bring that question into your manifestation practice and really rethink how you're asking for things. And I think that will take things to the next step beyond gratitude. Okay, I hope you found this video helpful. I'll see you next time.